Hello guys, welcome back to another video. So Renata just got released yesterday and I'm wondering, has anyone made a combo video? I, I think not. Let's make one. Let's go. QQ Auto. To recast your Q, press Q again and press your mouse over the direction that you want them to be pulled to. If you cast your Q on your snare target and it hits another enemy champion, at any part of the pool, it will stun them. What's crazy is that there's no limit to how many can be stunned. And as you can see, jungle mobs cannot be stunned when they smash into each other. When you Q something that is not a champion and then you try to throw it, it doesn't stun the enemy champion. Notice that during your first Q, you can't use your auto, but when the target doesn't have the hook on them, you can auto again. Also, when I was recording, where the f- where did her perfume machine go? What is this? What? If you Q flash, your Q will start at your original location. It will not follow the flash no matter what. Same goes for E. But not for R. Similar to how Senna faces towards the direction she flashes when she's in the middle of her R cast animation, Renata's RF does the exact same thing. EQ, you first cast your E to slow down the enemy, then try to hook the enemy with your Q. QE is faster than EQ and it makes it harder to see your Q coming out, but if you miss your Q, you will have to wait quite a while for it to come off cooldown. QQE And then there's the QEQ. During the 1 second snare, you cast your E somewhere and then pull them inside of it for them to get hit. This can sometimes be unavoidable for them as they immediately get slowed straight after they get pulled. Q's root will reveal invisible enemies. And every part of Renata's E does damage to enemies and shields allies. Your W will grant your target attack speed no matter what. But to gain the bonus movement speed, the ally has to be facing towards the enemy champions and they have to be visible to them as well. Renata's W revive can be confusing, so let me simplify it for you. When you cast W on an ally, the first time they die, they will be instantly revived to 100% HP. But... They will burn to death over 3 seconds. While burning to death, as long as they are able to get a kill or assist, they won't die. If an ally who has already been revived by your W, and you press W on them again, they can't be revived again. However, you can revive the same ally if the W on them expires. This clip I got from Legendary Clips without asking them, and potentially might get copyright claimed. This Olaf got revived three times, and every time that happened, the W that was on him expired, and then Renata placed another W on top of him. is possible, but when you use it, make sure that the enemies don't have their dashes or flashes, because it's much slower than just pressing Q. Q, R, Q, E. This makes it very likely for your pulled target to be immediately CC'd by your ult. If you have any questions or feedback, just write them down in the comments down below. My name is Tyron Brendorf and I make League of Legends support content. There's barely any gameplay videos, but yeah, I should really make some. Thank you for watching, see you again next time, I don't know when, but hopefully next time. See ya next time, bye bye.